Hello and welcome to even more Deadpool and Wolverine figures. We have Baby Pool in this micro fig, and the head does rotate. Hooray! Uh, the figure gold little bits painted on actually looks quite nice, but I already have way too many Deadpool figures, so I'm just gonna whatever I have, I'm just gonna choose the best versions and get rid of the rest, give them to kids to play around with toys and stuff. Uh, but this is very good, 360 degrees print. Even Baby Pool has back print. <laughs> Like, it's a, just a very good quality Deadpool. And we have yet another kid pool, but he has the hood down, which is... I've not seen that. Is that the hood from one of those Christmas sets, I think? Like a scarf? Uh, yeah, his print is really good. But he doesn't have some of the extra pieces that some of the other ones have. And his face mask is a bit too simple compared to some of the other ones. Because you got the stitch lining on the body, but there's no stitch lining on the mask, so this one is definitely not the best kid pool figure out there. We have another rough Sabertooth, and he also has the actual Lego claws that they copied. Um, I wish that it wasn't that. The last set, you still can look on the videos, last set, that Sabertooth looks... Mm, I prefer the look of the last one I did, but this one is more accurate to how Lego will print this. Like there's a bit of a cutesiness to this one, whereas the other one looks less cute and looks more like they're trying to emulate how he looks in the movie. So depending on what style, like if you like something that's more like an official Lego that's slightly cute, this is the one to go. If you want one that's less cute and more adult collector-like, then you get the one from the previous set that I reviewed. So you can take a look at that video as well. Uh, we have a cable. I think I have a cable at some point, but I mess around with so many of these minifigures I cannot remember. It'll be in a bag somewhere. But this is a good quality one. I'm not quite sure about the uh, the coloring, like this greenish blue is way too bright, but otherwise this is a decent looking uh, well-made cable. But this here, there we go, no back face print. Peter! This is one of the main reasons I got this set, it was by him. <laughs> It kind of looks like him. Um, I know this face is like a, one of those generic Lego faces, but the combination I've been coming together. Uh, it either looked like Peter or it looked like that guy from The Office, the American version. Um, yes, great. Uh, this figure is not great. Uh, it's very simple. It's, uh, this doesn't have like 360 print anything, but it looks the part, so well done. We have head pull. I mean, this, this looks good. Like, I already have a head pull, but I'm, so I'm going to decide, like, okay, which one I'm going to keep. But this looks really good. And the, uh, the propeller thing on the head that they've done looks nicer than the previous ones I've reviewed. Time Bureau guy. But this one's, like, dying because he's got an X face. He's being beat up by uh, Deadpool. He's got a regular face on the back. Now, the body is really good, but the helmets on all the other bootlegs look so much better. So, unfortunately, I will not be... This is not... I don't think you should get this one and get... Oh, Oh, it's worth keeping because they've used a regular Lego helmet and it's not accurate, but the body print is really good. But so are the body prints on the other ones that I've taken a look at. Like, the other ones look amazing as well, but they have, like, an actual new mold for the helmet that looks accurate. So, I mean, I guess if you want this head, this is a nice head. I mean, it's an X-Face head, but it's got, like, the straps on it, so you can take the head from this one. Uh, oh well, unfortunately. But, I mean, the plastic feels really good, but it's just not it. Uh, we have a nice pool hair piece here, but the Deadpool here, he's got bad face, so I don't know why he's got nice pool hair. Oh well. Last figure for... I don't know why there's a figure side in here. I guess they just ran out of things to do, so he's got silver legs with paint on top of it. And I was like, yeah, sure, why not? I'll take a figure side. I've never watched it, but I, I like the design and um, the clips are kind of funny and you know I like that era of um, Warner Brothers cartoon so uh, half decent figures half really random quality and randomish figures so uh, yeah um, I don't recommend this set too much because all these figures have been done in other sets previously uh, so I mostly just got this for Peter here and Freakasoid and I guess Cable is decent enough I prefer the other Sabertooth and the dead Pool head pull here is kind of nice, but if you're getting other sets and you already have a head pull, uh, unless you really like this particular design and you can get this on its own without getting the whole set, uh, there's not too much reason to get this. Which is, I mean, the, it's fine. It's just we've ha we have better options that are already out. Subscribe to just and comment below. Cause take care, have a nice day. I'll see you guys soon. Bye bye now.